first day of school for Brett and Katie and Ryan. All right, you guys, have a great day. Early school. Early school. Everybody wants to know. It's 6.20 in the morning. Katie's alarm's going off. Good morning, Katie. How are you, sweet pea? Tired. Yeah, I bet. What time did you get to bed last night? 12.30. That's not too terrible. Yeah. I see you finished your assignment. Congratulations. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, I'll get out of your hair. Don't get caught up in your phone, though. You should get up and get ready. This is Katie's AP assignment she had to finish last night. She's taking AP government. Is she had six pages. I sure will have homework to do before school started. So she finished that last minute last night. Do you want me to turn your light on for you? No. Okay. You should get out of bed though, baby girl. I understand. Can you please close my They're always so fun early in the morning. It's the first day of school for Brett and Katie and Ryan. And Katie and Brennan are in high school. Brennan's a junior this year. Katie's a sophomore. And Ryan has school. He's still in middle school. He's in eighth grade. Pardon me. But he doesn't go to school until later, like nine something. Anyway, so let's see what the first day of school looks like. Oh, this is exciting. All right, it looks like Brennan woke up already. I hear him in the bathroom. Ready for his first day of school. Alice, what do you think about all this? She's on my shoulder. She's like a little, um, she's like a parrot. I don't know if you guys can see this, but Alex, Alice hangs out on my shoulder. Hi, sweet girl. What do you see? Your brother's out there. He woke me up early this morning so he could go outside. You guys, Edward wakes me up every day at 5 a.m. so he can go outside. It's kind of a pain. I don't know how to stop it. But he just meows and meows and meows relentlessly until I let him outside, so I kind of have to give in. Katie's in the shower. Ryan's still asleep. Hi, Ryan. Good morning. What's up? Oh, you switched up on the outfit. I said to the, uh, I was thinking last night, and I was like, it's too boring, man. All right. Let's go through my closet, and I was like, I don't know. I got something jazzy. I like it. If you guys saw yesterday's video, where we said that what they picked out when they were going to end the first day of school. This is definitely not what Brennan picked out, but I like it. It looks great. Are you ready for a great day? Yes, I am. All right. I'm also hungry. I bet you are. Are you going to have some breakfast? Yeah. Okay. Oh, do you want to take an allergy medicine? It's Brennan's new backpack. Looking beautiful. I'll help you get your lunch in there. It's a big lunch. Apparently. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Their ride is here. Morning, Ethan. Ethan's a senior this year. All right, Ethan's here, but he's a little bit early, so Brian feels like he's got some time for breakfast. He's dressed. She is wearing the outfit that she picked out yesterday. All right, Kate, how can I help? You can put my makeup on for me. Oh my goodness. I can't do that. Oh my yeah, goodness. Yeah, I'll get out of the Okay. We need to get a picture. Hey, you guys, have a great day. I love you. You're welcome. Here they go. Another year bigger. Bye, Ethan. Bye. All right, now it's Ryan's turn. <clears throat> it is 8.20. Good morning, sleepyhead. Time to get up for school. It's the first day of school. <laughs> no, it's not. No, it's not. <laughs> You're gonna see all your friends. No, it's gonna be. I'm sorry about that. Okay, so if you don't go, you won't see them. Unless you hang out at the bus stop for when they come back. Hello. It's time to wake up. I already have no friends. <laughs> Listen, if I ever give one of my friends, I just. 
talk to the subscribers. So you just get me or something. That's right. I don't okay, know. you don't need school. I don't need school. I don't need school. No one needs school. I just ask you guys uh, math questions. Perfect. <laughs> exactly. Send me your homework. I know you could say. Send me your homework and I'll do it. What time is it? 8.20. Yeah. Wait, 8.20? I know. Mom! What? Did you no. say more? Why? Did you say more? 8.20? Mom, we practiced this all last year. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ryan is up and already complaining about himself, but he looks Charlie like a million dollars. Charlie hasn't seen Jawline because mm -hmm. he's skinny. He doesn't eat anything. Oh my gosh. So his jawline, you can like see it. That I'm like, so I'm weird. jealous. Look at that hair. Mm. Yeah. Look at that hair. Look at that hair. Excellent. All right, come on over and have some breakfast. Are you ready for school? Yeah. Yeah? No. No? Leave here in what? Can you leave here in 10 minutes? Oh, shoot. What? Right. <laughs> you actually have to go. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I thought this was just practice. Right, for now tomorrow. this is the real thing. So what are you eating this morning? Life. Life cereal. We packed your lunch. You finally got life cereal. I didn't eat life cereal all, all this summer. All summer. Peanut butter and jelly, goldfish, Nesquik, grapes. Okay. Bam. You guys, this is our bag of bars. You want a cliff bar? Do you want peanut butter? Oh, yeah, please. All right, peanut butter cliff bar it is. But. Excellent day. All right, we'll catch up with you in just a few minutes. Okay. All right. You're looking great. Yeah, thank you. Confident, smart, like an eighth grader. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I almost forgot. Whoa. Is the flying armatron. There it is, his watch. Yeah, you can't. can't. It, you can't call it a watch, it's Sorry. called a timepiece. A timepiece. That's what people that own like Patek Philippe's call it. Okay, timepiece. <laughs> Yeah. Fantastic. All right, we'll let you eat with your beautiful time okay, piece. Okay, I'll get time piece. Mm. Um, you are smart and sophisticated all in yep. one, Ryan. Yep. Ryan, are you nervous? No. Are you kidding me? Eighth grade. King of school. Okay. It's like asking a boss if he's nervous to go into work. No. No. Oh. He's just, he's looking down at everyone. He's like, so, that's that's me. I should probably be looking at I love what people. <laughs> But metaphorically, I'll be looking down. Nice. Nice. And you should act like that too. Walk in like, ah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, might, I might give a little, little to be toe, like a little bit of that. Don't mm. want people look at my feet, just go like that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So. Yep. Walk tall and proud, Ryan. Oh, you got gosh. this. You got this. You got school. Thank you got you. eighth grade. You got classes. You got the social thing going on. You got the outfit. All right, here we go, let me get your picture. Oh, look how handsome you look. I'm so proud of you. Uh-huh, look at you. The future is bright, baby. All right, All right have also, a fantastic. the sun is good. It's raining really hard. Have a great day at school. I love you. Thank you, love you too. Bye. Bye. Look at you, you want a belly rub, don't you? Do you miss the kids when they're at school? Do you miss them? I understand, I do too. We had a nice summer and now, actually we had an amazing summer and now they're at school. All right, lovey girl. We'll just wait till everybody comes home, okay? Okay, let's do that. I have some work to do. I went for a run, going to lunch with some friends. I'm sure you can do just fine, okay, Boker Poops? I know, I'll be here for you. Edward followed me up the road. I should have filmed him when I went for my run. He was like, hey, Mom, where are you going? Look at Alice, she's sitting there waiting. She's like, please come home. Please come home. All right, you guys, well, that's it. The kids will be coming home from school soon, and I cannot wait to hear all about their day and how everything went. Dad and I had the opportunity to meet um, Katie, most of Katie and Brendan's teachers when we went to back to school night. So there's certain teachers, oh, I mean, they're all wonderful, but specific ones that are new that I'm pretty excited for them to both meet and I hope that it goes well. But some of those they won't meet till tomorrow because we have A, B, A days and B days. So they'll have their A day schedule and their B day schedule. But I remember and I was reminiscing earlier today about the first day Brendan went off to kindergarten, which was like, seems like yesterday and now he's a junior in high school. And I was thinking about how 
um, some of my friends, they would cry like when their kids would get on the bus and they were going out. And I didn't cry when Brendan went to kindergarten. Um, the reason I didn't cry is because I was so excited for his new adventure and I just knew that he had everything that he needed to go off and like do something wonderful. And um, I feel the same way today about the kids. Although on the flip side, it makes me sad because every year it's another grade and it's another year closer to them leaving my little nest. Which I know they have to do and I know it's inevitable, but um, I just feel like you don't get enough time with them. 18 years isn't enough. So if they want to live with me, they can live with me. But they shouldn't. They should go off and do their thing. But as long as they promise to always come back. But anyway, that's pretty deep. I apologize. I don't mean to get so deep. But it's like this time every year when that happens. So thank you guys so much for watching today we hope you enjoyed today's video of the kids getting ready for school their first day of school and stay tuned because tomorrow you get to see what it looked like when they came home from school and how they thought their days went so thanks again for watching um, comment below what you guys did today or how your first day of school went or if you remember like your first day of kindergarten or what your thoughts are on growing up and getting out <laughs> thanks again see you tomorrow bye Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.